Ever since 2017, the young boy has always wanted to play classic arcade titles on his phone since most people were capable of doing that, but he didn't know how to. But thanks to MAME for Droid, an app that he discovered and learned how to use, he finally made that reality come true, and thanks to that he was able to play his favorite game. Now, today marks the 5th anniversary for this young man's channel. Now watch as he plays his classic favorite games on the arcade for his anniversary in today's video. My life's a story before me And I'll try and find a way to be free finally I'll reach the new world Tomorrow brings a new game It's time to learn the pain is gain Already fight Hey guys, what's going on? It's ya boy Bowser Jr. Fan 13 And guess what today is? Today marks the 5th anniversary for my channel Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're so kind. Anyways, so for today's special anniversary, uh, since I've managed to uh, work out the arcade emulator on my phone, thanks to this app called Mame for Droid, and I learned how to use it, I can play some arcade games. So I'm going to be playing a total of six games in today's video, so enjoy them while you can. And let me know if you guys want to see me play more of these games um, after this video. So yeah, anyways, enjoy! Okay, so starting off the list, we're starting off with Marvel vs. Capcom, my favorite uh, arcade game. This one is like a real true classic, I love it. Alright, sorry, just gotta make sure the volume is really good. You know, it's honestly kind of surprising how um, uh, Marvel and Capcom managed to make an awesome crossover like this. And I know some of you are waiting for a new Marvel vs. Capcom game, so am I. That's why later on uh, on this channel I'm going to have a big discussion about what to expect for Marvel vs. Capcom 4. And this is a really cool title screen. All right, let's start playing the game. All right, so I'm gonna be playing this game as my mains. My mains are Mega Man and Gambit. All right, let's do this. Oh yeah, you can also summon uh, some characters to help you out and switch out your partners in this game. I mean, because that's uh, what Marvel vs. Capcom's about, like, it's teamwork. I love Mega Man's hyper combo. Turning into that big robot thing is just so cool. Alright, let me switch out. Alright, Gambit, take care of him. I swear, Gambit's moveset is so cool. Damn, Wolverine, chill. You just fell from my trap. Yeah, what he said. Alright, next game. Alright, so the next game we are playing, it's a Mega Man game. Alright, so this game I've already played before, 
it was like on what some type of uh uh yeah it was like some type of app that like had these type of emulators um basically let you play these for free um i don't know what type of apps these were but it was cool that i got to play this game and its sequel all right so this is Mega Man: the power battle all right let's get started All right, so we can play as Mega Man, Proto Man, and Base. Well, I've played Mega Man in the last game, so let's go with Base. And I think it'd be fitting if we do Mega Man 7. All right, so I'll go through two stages in this game. And my first opponent is Shade Man. All right. Is it me, or do the graphics look a little bit off? I mean, Mega Man and Proto Man's graphics are based off of Mega Man uh, 7's, but Base's graphics kind of look a little off. I mean, I, I mean, maybe it's just me. Because uh, I thought it'd be based more on Mega Man 7, but it's whatever. Alright, let's do one more stage, then we move on to the next game. Alright, so we got the noise crush, or crash noise as this game likes to call it. And our next opponent is Turbo Man. Alright. Dang, I forgot how do you uh, I, I, I forgot how do you uh slide in this game. Oh shoot. Yo, chill. Phew, that was close. All right, next game. All right, so you guys remember in one of my longest videos that I made games that I would play on each console like remember when I said one of the games that I wish to play on arcade would be this game called Pretty Soldier Sailor Moon because of course uh, I love Sailor Moon the anime is cool and I'd love to play this game because it's so cool well now I got my chance to play it and it's so cool. And there's the Sailor Scouts. Alright. So this game is a beat em up game and you can choose to play between the uh between the Sailor Scouts and stuff. Alright, I think we'll play a Sailor Moon since she's the main star. Sorry, I just need to make sure that the volume was good. Alright. So this is a beat-em-up game, as you can tell. Alright. Yeah, take that, punk. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's what you get. Alright, I think you can activate special moves in this game. Uh, I just gotta see uh, which um, button was it. Uh, but I'm gonna save uh, the special moves for later. Oh yeah, this game also kind of has a little bit of a time limit, so... You might want to watch out. Uh, though, I don't think the time limit does too much to you. But, I don't want to know what happens if I run out of time, though. 
Oh, got a lollipop. Oh, no, I didn't, I don't want to do that. Okay, but this is one of the special moves that you can use. Uh. Uh. Oh. Alright, there we go. So, it was one of the special moves you could do. I think this is like a screen nuke. It basically, like, wipes out all enemies on screen. Okay, now here comes one of the most, uh, I think the most annoying bosses of all time. And I apologize for that noise because this is literally the type of sound effect that these bosses make. I don't know why they program the bosses to make this type of noise, but it's so annoying. And they're so... Okay, that's not fair. Man, I wish I wish my buddies were here to help me out because they would have helped me kick these girls' butts. Whoa. Okay. Alright. Whoa. Alright. Alright, let me try a special move. Alright. Wait. Oh, shoot. Alright. Alright, there we go. Alright, let's try another special move. Oh, that doesn't seem to do anything. Yo, stop! Chill! I got him. Yeah, there we go. Alright, now we move on to the next game. Alrighty, everyone. So, for those of you who missed YouTube Combat so much... It has begun! Mortal Combat For the arcade. Alright. I'm gonna go with my boy Scorpion. Alright, so we're gonna start out with Liu Kang. Alright, Liu Kang, let's do this. Alright. Oh yeah. Next game. Alrighty. Alrighty. So now we are about to play some Street Fighter Alpha. If you guys remember a long time ago I played Street Fighter Alpha 2 on the channel. So now I'm gonna play some Street Fighter Alpha 1. I love these type of intros in the Street Fighter Alpha series. They look like they belong in an anime. Speaking of anime, Street Fighter Alpha actually had its own uh, uh, anime movie, if you guys didn't know. But yo. Alright, so we're gonna stick with Ryu. And we're gonna fight Rose first. Let's do this. Yeah, you ain't got nothing on me, Rose. Alright. 
Yo, I can't wait to play Street Fighter uh, 4 on the channel. Oh yeah, I got Street Fighter 4 on my uh, 3DS. I'll play that uh, eventually. Anyways. So yeah, I bet you guys missed me playing video games on the channel, huh? Well, don't worry. There will be more uh, soon. Just trust me. But I won't give up on animations, though. I'll do both animations and gaming like I usually do. Alright. Next up. Okay, so I saved this one for last. So I discovered this franchise, and this is another one made by Capcom. And I'm gonna be honest, this is a really cool game. Alright. This franchise is called Darkstalkers, and I'm about to play one of the best games in the series. And that game just so happens to be... Wait for it. Yeah, look at this intro. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Vampire Savior, Lord of the Vampire, or otherwise known as Darkstalkers 3, because this is the Darkstalkers franchise. Alright, now, let's get started. So this is a fighting game, just like Street Fighter, and you have all your variety of different types of characters and stuff. Alright, I'm gonna go with Morgan, she's my favorite. All right, Sienko, let's go. Yeah, come on, you got nothing on me. Oh, you think you're slick, huh? Alright, I see you. But it's not good enough. All right, it's payback time. Yeah, there you go, Morgan. Okay, and that was the last game on the on the list. Well, that was pretty fun. Anyways, so that's all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and thank you for supporting this channel. It's been around for five years, even though I started YouTube in 2017. 2016 is where it was created, but anyways, that's not important. What's in, what is important is just thank you guys so much for supporting me. I appreciate you. I love all of my fans. Everyone who has supported me, thank you. Um, if you want to see more content, be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, uh, and let me know in the comments down below if you guys want to see me replay these games, uh, that I was just playing, and I'll see you guys next time, and I'll think of playing those again. So, peace out, everyone, and thank you so much for five years.